to the channel. I hope you guys are doing great. Y'all, let's go ahead and tap into the energy. Holy Spirit, can I have the energy for this read? Y'all, I'm watching Lilo and Stitch for the first time. And I'm sorry, but Lilo was bad as hell. And Stitch was bad as hell, too. Now, I ain't finished the movie, so I don't know, like, the ending yet. It's still playing, but it's on silent. But um, maybe it gets better, but, like, I don't like it. I don't like it. So far, I'm gonna, we'll see. Okay, all right, so you about to get justice, okay? Boy, the whole deck just flipped over in my hand. Okay, the queen of swords. All right, so you've defeated someone or something's been defeated. I'm also hearing that something's been overturned or overruled, okay? The eight of cups, okay? Somebody was trying to walk away. Someone else didn't want them to, okay? You could be divorced, the death card. Ooh, but it's over. Somebody could have been trying to prevent someone from walking away. The devil. Somebody's obsessed. Somebody could have been obsessed with you and didn't want you to walk away. Okay? Yeah, they don't want you to leave this commitment. The hair fine. Something about a court case is significant. Or you could have something about maybe a divorce. Okay? The two of cups. Yeah. It's definitely about a relationship or partnership that you're rejecting okay the six of cups this could be someone from your past or childhood or y'all have a past or history with this person one person was over it one person still wanted to give it a try okay the high priestess is here somebody could have went to a practitioner on this note okay went to a practitioner all right the world car is they wanted to like affect a cycle or make a like they wanted to change a cycle Okay, someone's period could have changed. All right, the Knight of Wands in the reverse. Okay, somebody didn't want someone to take action. The Knight of Cups. Somebody wanted someone to believe someone's bullshit or lies. All right, the Six of Swords, but somebody sailed away from this person anyway. Okay, the Magician is here. Okay, I feel like somebody's been trying to manifest a reunion. Yeah, the King of Pentacles. Um, but it's a no. It's a, It's not a no. It's a hell to the no. Okay, the Four of Pentacles. You already know to protect yourself from this person. This person don't mean you no know well. I don't know why they want to be back at your energy. But they could be trying to tell you because I want you back. I want, I want our life together. Yeah, they see you as the Empress. But all they did was had you off balance. Okay, this person is not your person the ace of pentacles but they want another opportunity with you or they could only be coming around because they're an opportunist the eight of wands they want something that you have or want something from you somebody feels like they want to take something from you the page of swords the four of swords okay it's giving a vibe of like the five of swords okay and this is causing a tower so the moment that they think that they can take something from you or that they attempt to take something from you they're going to be hit with a tower okay I feel like somebody tried to, to take something from you and they ended up in a tower. The seven of wands, you're extremely protected. You're also fully capable of operating your own vessel. So somebody was trying to interfere, okay, out of their ego, the nine of wands. They could feel um, triggered by you, okay? All right, the queen of cups. This could be um, a f another feminine that's triggered by you jealous or envious of you the ten of swords maybe someone ended things with this person the nine of swords and they have regrets okay they could have some regrets all right uh, the ace of swords is significant okay judgment someone made a judgment call about this person maybe after receiving some form of truth and clarity about this person the six of wands okay or some uh, uh, about like a, a somebody receiving some type of success or recognition the knight of pentacles or about someone receiving an offer or that's when they wanted to turn around and give somebody an offer the lovers okay it's like that's when they wanted to offer their love is when they realized that somebody was a success somebody could have became a celebrity then or won the lottery or like was winning in some type of way and then somebody was like oh i want to go back oh that's my person oh i want you now like what Okay, the hangman and the nine of cups. <laughs> yeah, it's like before they was trapped, they wasn't making no moves or they was stagnant. And then like all of a sudden, oh, I want, I know what I want. Yeah, like all of by surprise. Oh, you're my ten of cups. You're my happily ever after. Like what was you doing before I started winning? 
the Knight of Swords being argumentative, trying to move too fast, the Two of Swords causing heartbreak, the Three of Swords is here, right? So it's like all you was doing was causing me trauma and drama and heartbreak and pain. But when you realize like I was winning and I was doing my thing and I was shining and I was successful or I, I created something that was successful or I built something that's successful or I was getting justice, that's when you wanted to come back around? No, it's still a no. I'm hearing you better call Tyrone. Three of Swords, I told y'all it was here. Yeah, no. Now they're heartbroken because you want to be free. I want to be free, okay? You're claiming your independence from this person because you know they're a liar, a deceiver, a heartbreaker, okay? The Six of Cups, okay? You guys could have went to school together, all right? At one point, that relationship could have been innocent, but I feel like that's what they wanted to steal. Somebody wanted to steal your innocence, or you could have been naive to this person, the King of Cups, but now you know, and when you know better, you do better, right? So now you know better. You're like, nah, I see a snake a mile away, okay? The Queen of Wands, all right? So you took your power back. Now that you know better, you're doing better. This is knowing, feeling emotional. It's like knowing something emo emotionally and then applying that pressure. So it's like, no, your no is no and your yes is yes. Maybe you've learned the power in that. Maybe before you would just kind of go along with whatever. But now you're like, nah, I know what to do. The, the cherry and you take an action. You moved away from this person. You went after your ten of pentacles. And that's what I'm saying. This person knows either you didn't came into some type of money. You got someone could have passed away. You could have gotten some money um, from someone's passing. You could have been in someone's will, or it's given a vibe of like you're creating something, something that has to do with a legacy, or you're building a legacy or generational wealth. And somebody sees that they like, oh, this person about their business. Yeah, well, keep it pushing. You was over there doing what you was doing. Go back to doing that. Don't try to reverse uh, and turn around now. Like, mm mm. It's like some, now somebody wants to pay you some attention because you they see you building generational wealth, okay? Or they see you to you done became your own business owner, or you're 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 putting some you're investing some type of money into yourself, okay? Or you just you're a boss, or you became a manager. I don't know. Somebody is like, oh, they bossed up, or they they're le like I don't know. Somebody you could have came into some type of wealth here, and Aries could be significant, doesn't have to be. Or this is how this emperor could be looking at you, like, oh, they got money now. Let me go reunite. Yeah, somebody wants to reconcile with you because they see that you have some type of generation generational wealth. You could have been handed down something from an ancestor, or someone could have left something to you. Like you could be a caregiver of an elderly an elderly person and this elderly person could pass away and they're going to leave you a lot of money okay it's like that's when your ex is going to want to come back when they find out like oh he kicked the bucket you know what i'm saying like what the hell three of wands nah keep that space and opportunity this person was acting distant before continue to tell them to keep that same energy you know what i'm saying these people got <laughs> the game messed up what the heck yeah but here they come the page of pentacles Oh, baby, can I take you out? Oh, baby, can I call you? Can I, you know, hey, what you doing? You getting that text? No, nah, or that little email? No. Nah. Okay, you might leave outside your job one day. They outside, okay? The king of wands, the five of pentacles. No, leave them in that same energy, okay? Leave them where they, where they left you at. Meet them where they no. You need to you need to continue to apply pressure and letting your no be your no and your yes be your yes. Cause these people is tripping. I'm telling you now they want to work with you. Here's the eight of pentacles. This could now I'm telling you somebody's gonna pull up outside of your job. Like er hey, what's up? Can we talk? Hell no. You still a burden in my book. You know what I'm saying? The ten of wands. They're going to be heavily burdened by your decision to let your no be your no and your yes be your yes. I feel like you're giving to yourself. Things are equal now. That's what I'm saying. You're telling somebody, keep that same energy, right? This is reciprocity. This is equal give and take. This is fairness. It was only fair. You you know, you was holding back when we were, you know, we was doing what we doing. I'm, something very, this could, maybe you, this was a workplace relationship. You met someone at work. They realize like, oh, you getting promoted. They like, oh, let me get back on your team. No, <laughs> no, and no. Let your no be your no and your yes be your yes. Okay, these people are going to be exposed. 
They're going to be exposed. Oh, okay. Um, I'm hearing shade room. All right. The moon in the reverse. The ace of wands. Yeah, there's a new start here for you. And you're going to go, you're going to accept that. Whatever that new start is, you're going to accept that. That's what's going to bring you justice. Yeah, this is like your success is going to be the flex in this energy, the two of pentacles. They juggled you. They couldn't make a decision or they was trying to, they was trying to do the job of too many men or too many women. And it's like you confirmation. Okay, you came in and you just, okay. Oh my goodness. I'm hearing, let's go, let's go, little kitty cat. He don't want no more. <laughs> okay, Beyonce. A Virgo could be significant. You know I hate sleeping alone. Mm -mm 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 -mm. I'm hearing that, okay? Let's go, little kitty cat. He don't want no more. <laughs> Who are you telling this to? Okay, so the full card. Aries could be significant. The five of cups. Someone could be feeling foolish. They could be crying over you. Because they see you in your bag. They see you. You got that money, honey. Wow. This is interesting. So somebody's only trying to come back around because you're winning. Or because they realize that you're a hard worker. Or that you're, you're leveling up. Or you're getting a promotion. Or you're expanding. Or your money is on the rise. You came into some type of well. The strength card. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You don't need them, though. You're going to show them. you like, I could show you better than I could tell you. I don't need you. I'm hearing to the left, to the left. Everything you own in a box to the left. In the closet. That's my stuff. Yep, if I bought it. Please don't touch. And keep talking that mess, that's fine. But can you walk and talk at the same time, man? Because <laughs> ah, it's my name that's on that chat. So go get your bag. I'm going to call you a cab. Okay. <laughs> this is funny. Who is this? Dude is like, oh, my God. Oh, oh. <laughs> wow. I hate to laugh that hard, but it's funny because of the songs I'm getting. Spirit, they like, mm-mm, keep that same energy. The Ace of Swords, though. Yeah, you done found out some type of truth and clarity about this person or their motives. You, this is an opportunist. Somebody is like, nah, you an opportunist. It's like they, they expose themselves. Oh, you were only in it for the money. Oh, there was, oh, okay. It wasn't ever about the love. Oh, okay. It was only what I could do for you. How they used to say in my old job, whiffums, what's in it for me? <laughs> That's the type of vibe right here. That's how this, this person is like, okay, if I spend time with you, what am I getting out of it? If I take you out, what am I getting in return? If I buy you this, if I buy you McDonald's, you know what I'm saying? What, what I'm getting? Like, this this the only way they would make a move is if they, they felt they were getting something in return. You don't operate that way. Whoever you are, you were doing something out of the kindness of your heart because that's what you wanted to do or you were guided to do. Not because you were expecting anything in return. But this person revealed their card. Damn. They exposed themselves. They could have even blatantly said it like, oh, if I do that for you, what you going to do for me? Excuse me? Excuse me? <laughs> do what now? If I do what for you, what you going to do for What are you talking about? Yeah, you was confused. You was like, come again? Uh, Repeat yourself? I feel like you saw them as somebody that was just 777 seven, seven energy. You could be seeing a lot of sevens. But you, I feel like you saw this person as someone that was just along for a good time, but not a long time. These cards just fell out of my hand. The Hermit. King of Swords, and the Temperance Angel. What I'm getting with this energy right here is that your ancestors gave you this revelation. Your ancestors made you, whatever you happened up on, because you saw something. You could have saw a conversation or an email or something on social media, a post, or you know what I mean? Somebody slid into someone's DMs. This was meant for you. That was, that was you found that on purpose. I don't know who message this is. 777 energy very strongly but you found that on purpose your ancestors set up that play because they feel like you deserve better than what you were getting 
they knew that this was an opportunist. They was just waiting on you to realize it. I'm hearing point in case. I'm hearing indeed. Yeah, the Ten of Swords. I feel like you even tried to play like everything was okay. Like you tried to act like you didn't see what you saw, but you saw it. And it was meant. It was put there by your ancestors. Your ancestors wanted you to see this. This person was delaying you. They were slowing you down. This truth was meant to be discovered with the King of Swords.